Well, remember last summer, the Norfolk Admirals won the Calder Cup championship. The city threw the guys a party. They had that big parade. What a season. Remember the win streak? Well, then a week after the playoffs, the Tampa Bay Lightning packed everything up and moved the entire team players, coaches, everybody to Syracuse where they became the Syracuse Crunch. Well, today they returned to Scope and Brian Parsons was there to meet them. It's not every day that a couple of dozen fans come to Scope to watch the Admiral's opponent practice. All right, why are you out here? To watch them practice. Who practice? The Admiral, I mean, the Crunch. But then again, it's not very often that a Calder Cup champion team switches affiliations. As was the case last year when the Tampa Bay Lightning ended their agreement in Norfolk and moved the team to Syracuse. These guys won for the Admirals last year and now they're playing against the Admirals. So I, I think that's kind of tough. And the fans aren't the only ones feeling the emotional tug of war. You know, it's one of those things that's kind of sad to come back and, and, and see where you lived for two years and you made a home of and you met a lot of good people and a great community. A whole ton of emotions, excitement, sadness. Coach Cooper said these games were circled on the calendar when the season started. And when he walked into Scope, he and his team finally got to see the championship banners that they earned last year. It's, uh, it's, it's weird to see them up there, especially, you know, because we weren't here to, to see them be raised. but. Uh, uh, a lot of, I think everybody in the building is going to know, uh, you know, where they came from and, and how they got here. Fan favorite Eric Nielsen can't wait for the puck to drop tomorrow night. It's exciting. It's fun. I mean, won a championship here last year, so it's awesome. We, uh, we're staying down the road there and you know, Granby Street and the walk to the rink. It was uh, brought back a lot of memories. It was awesome. 16 former Admirals are on the Crunch roster, and it's going to be interesting to see how a packed scope responds to those players who are now members of the opposition. I think we'll have some people here to support us. Obviously, you know, they're still going to cheer for Norfolk. They're going to be excited. They're just as excited as we are. I mean, this is, we have a lot of, uh, a lot of great memories here in this rink. And no matter where these players and coaches end up as their careers progress, there's going to be a soft spot in their hearts for Norfolk. Regardless of wherever these guys end up or wherever I end up, uh, this will always have a special place. In Norfolk, Brian Parsons for the Sports Wrap.